Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how you can add water condensation to your 3D models completely for free inside Blender. So first you want to download this free geometry node setup which was released by Josiah. I'm going to be leaving a link down in the description where you can download just the geometry node setup or my example scene as well. So once you've downloaded these, you'll have either one or two different Blender files that you can open up and we want to open up the condensation particles one first. And once you've got that open up, you're going to be presented with this Blender file here. Now this is immediately going to show you some instructions on how to proceed forward. And this is basically instructing you that you need to put this Blender file into your Blender asset library. And if you don't know how to do that, we're going to go into our preferences and then under file paths, you can see asset libraries here. Now I already have mine in here, but just in case I didn't, let's remove this one, click the plus button to add a new one. And then we're going to either locate our asset library or we're going to create one. Now I already have one here, so I'm just going to click add asset library. And now that we have this one all finished, we can go and save it. As you can see, I already have one in here, but we will just click save as. And now that we have that saved, we can open up a new scene. So we have a completely blank scene here in Blender and let's just add in a 3D can model. And now we're just going to drag our timeline up and change this over to the asset browser. From there, you'll be shown a bunch of brushes, but we want to go to our own asset library and find where we just saved it, which mine was under nodes. And now you should have this condensation particles node set up right here. We'll click and drag that onto our 3D model. And now you can see we have a bunch of blobs around here, but we don't want to be looking at those at all. So go over to our collections and just click this checkbox here. And now we can only see our can model. And you can already see that we have some condensation applied to it. So once we click on our can model and then go into our modifiers, we can see this condensation particles geometry nodes set up. And from here, customization is made super easy. Everything is labeled for you. So density controls how much particles there are. The max size changes how big the particles can be and the minimum size, how small they can be. You can change the randomization of it by changing the seed. And if we go into our material preview, you can see it already has a water material applied to it. Now, because this is just a click and drag setup, it makes setting up a scene exactly like this super easy. You can do it within minutes and you have a really clean professional looking render with some really nice looking condensation. So I hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you want even more free resources and tutorials for Blender, don't forget to hit subscribe and check the links in the description if you want to download this setup completely for free.